Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Darker, and we are here in One Human. I'll be showing you the best place to get, like, uh, contaminated plants, like the wheat and berries and whatnot. And along with that, some good materials, like, uh, ores and possibly silver. Um, we can do... Oh, damn. Oh no, there's an error. Oh, there's an error with the overwolf one. So, that's fine. If you're using the overlay, um, it will detect where, like, the ores are. And it will show you on the map, which is pretty cool. But since it's not working, I'll show you where I farm. Oh, and you can get, um, the Star Tracer ore. So, Stardust ore. So we come here, you see that building. That means we're here. And this is where you farm it. So what I'd do is I would... Well, definitely not with that. We're in phase one, this is like the best spot. And we just go around. The gravel and go in a backpack here would be great. Uh, you can harvest these, and then you just go over here, check right here. I normally come here for the iron ore too. And yes, I am almost level 50. There's four more levels. Um, once we do, I will be doing a live stream of when the next phase is. Maybe I'll hit 50 before then. Um, so I come around in circles. People have been putting camps around here, which is pretty interesting. We just make the circle. Shellfish. Um, I think there's tin. Yep. This is one of the spots that can have it. Pretty much, I just take out everything. Those are normal. Doesn't look like there's any contaminated yet. There's also another spot. It'll spawn here too. So we just come back around. And then if you haven't noticed, the two iron that we did right here has already been respawned. Look at that. So, oh, there's that, and then there's this one. And you also want to pick. So if you break these, it will get it to respawn. This tends to be a, um, spawn too, so there's that. Uh, being really glitchy, and uh, we come over here again. They do have, like, a tendency to double up like that. Oh man, I'm already overweight. And then if we come over here... Is gonna trigger it? No. Look over there, there's a Star Tracer ore. Oh, it won't pop up, but in the left hand corner, it will, will, uh, if you're in on an account that hasn't done the area, I'll show you, like, the stuff that you need to do, and then you just come out. Right here is also a spawn. You could destroy those to get it to spawn. Um, the more you things you pick and destroy, the more likely it will get replaced with, like, uh, like the Star. Stardust store, like this one right here. And that's all you do. You just run the circle. It's literally right here on the map. So you make your way to this teleportation, come down, and boom. It's the uh, Ripple, Ripple Bee or Ripple Bye. And it's a great place to farm copper, sulfur, um, gravel, 
all those gravels, sulfur, uh, silver, sometimes tin, and a lot of iron will sometimes spawn here. Because of those two spots right there, those, those, sometimes within here too. And then the ones on the beach you want to do too. Like I said, they do respawn as soon as you go into the area right there. And then come out. What is that behind it? We can take the rock instead. There's the tin. And then you have the chance of them spawning as silver. Boom. And yeah, I just recommend doing this in your season in your season one slash phase one to farm and you'll have a lot of maps and um, I know that you have to harvest a lot of the contaminated plants in order to get one seed. Uh, I do have a few I can show. Um, let me finish this run right here. I don't see one spawning, but I'm not harvesting everything. If you harvest all of that, I think that's... That looks like silver. No. That's tin. But I just highly recommend like harvesting all of these right here to get it to uh, respawn as one. And right there. Boom. We have one that spawned. You can collect it. Oh, how lucky is that? I get one berry seed. And then, oh, it's on cooldown. You know what? Do this. We'll teleport to here. We can ride back up. So that's a quick way to get materials. You can get all that fun stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my next video. You can actually also, by the way, you can also use the Eternal Land trick. Um, in my previous video, you'll see me doing it for the fetch a lot on the big tree you can do it that way too if you don't have uh, if you're doing a different area and did i just see yeah so if you're if you're gonna do that you can do it like so with the eternal land trick so yeah well subscribe leave a like comment and i'll see you guys in my next video